The noises they're making is so adorable. Oh my god. That's so adorable. I have to kill it. I couldn't help it. It's so adorable. And it gave me glow blocks. Oh my god. How could anything so cute be so killable? Wait. Um. You guys didn't hear that last bit. <laughs> Hello everyone. My name is Dark Ravenick. And welcome back to Stella... Oh, wait, is that... Stella Overload, and when was there a crack here in the floor? I never even noticed that before. <laughs> anyway, last time we left off, we finally did that annoying, annoying quest. The, uh, footsteps of Phileas, uh, Philly, Philly, whatever. And then we basically got blueprints for building a spaceship. And we found that I have lacking of, uh, certain blueprints needed to build certain stuff. So, I went on to the internet, you know, like you normally do when you can't figure out something, uh, to find out what's going on. And, uh, at most, it says last year people, no, there was glitches that prevented monsters from dropping the blueprints. It sounds like it was fixed, but it also sounded like those same monsters, uh, were found on different planets. I don't think the other planet is what I need, you know, I think I might need to actually fly into space. So, uh, hasn't left me with many choices, but to basically build myself a spaceship and go into space in hopes of finding bad guy robots to kill and... Yeah, I don't know how this is going to go. Oh, um, let's see, uh, is there a construction? Spaceships. To build a spaceship, you first need to place the... Gyrograv grav block. The gyrograv block is the combination between a gyroscope and an anti-grav block. The gyro part allows the spaceship to turn itself on all directions. The grav removes it from gravity, of course. If the elements placed on this gyrograv block will be- Oh wait, all the elements I meant to say. Will be part of the vehicle and add to its weight. Yeah, 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 won't fly as high nor as fast as a lightweight one. And a really he heavy one might not fly at all, so keep in mind the cube load is heavier. But- then I could just add more, right? Construction of a spaceship is limited to one one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cockpit of a small spaceship can be located anywhere in the construction space as long as it is linked to the gyrogas block. The vehicle can move up to six directions, provided it pro uh, pro possesses six thrust. Uh, bleh, whatever. I'm just bleh. a thruster facing down will allow it to raise. <laughs> What is wrong with me? Will that to rise and whereas one facing forward will add to move forward to the R. Destroy the gyrograv block or the spaceship will not destroy the vehicle. The remaining pieces will simply fall to the ground. Kaboom. Use the spaceship. Navigating a spaceship is more complex compared to hover bikes. Mouse up, mouse down, left, right, control the heading a ship. Um it doesn't say anything about say uh do I need to uh seal myself off in a room or anything like that? Uh, c c uh, can I safely fly in a spaceship without suffocating myself? Hells if I knew. Uh, so, uh, let's grab all this weird stuff. Infinite power source. I don't even know where I got that from. Do I need it for a spaceship? I don't know. I know nothing. This is my first ever spaceship, and I'm excited. Uh, uh, uh. I mean, I could probably use a uh, use this to build a spaceship, but I suspect I might need that duplicator thingy to do it. So yeah, I don't exactly have that duplicator thingy now, do I? <laughs> so it's a sort of lose-lose situation. One gyro grab block coming right up. Ooh. Doink. No, doink. Ooh. If I bump it, will it just float off into the distance? Sounds like a very bad idea to bump it. Whoa, peacocky's getting all peacocky over there. 
So, uh, what's my lightest main around? They're all the same? Okay. What's my most frequent and common metal? It's, uh... I have lots and lots of this metal plate. So, uh... Crouch? This is the first time I've ever actually built anything in this game. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> but isn't that just part of the core for me? I never know what I'm doing. I do it anyway. Because it's funny. <laughs> this is going to be so screwy. Uh, um... Yeah, yeah, um, 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 oh, yeah, 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 spaceship cockpit. Put that there, and thrusters, put that there. One cockpit will go. Uh, how do I rotate this thing? You know, when you never built anything before, you don't know which way things go. Uh, uh I should check the instructions on this. Okay, so I go... T. No. R. Aha! It works! Ah. Uh, we'll put you right... Here. And I put you in the wrong spot! Okay, let's try again! Ah, oh, much better. Okay. Next, we'll put some thrusters on. Uh, these are some very big thrusters, actually. Uh, there. 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 Oh, uh, I was worried that it was going to go collapse on me or something. There, and finally. There! Vroom. It worked! Whoa, whoa, whoa! This thing's got some oomph on it! You know, this place uh, uh, outside might not even need to worry about needing air because this, I don't remember seeing oxygen in this game. Holy oh, hell, this gyroscope is twitchy! Uh. Uh. Holy crap! Do I have any. Um. So, swapper there. That there, but do I have any any uh, crates or something? I'm gonna throw them on there. I think I put all the crates in here. Uh, ouch, my legs. Okay, crates, 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 crates. Think. Um. But I could have sworn I had crates. Oh, is that? Oh, here we go. One crate. And some more crates. Small and large. <laughs> I wonder if these laser blocks will work. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> La laser blocks. And then toot. <laughs> yeah. We'll throw some laser blocks on the front. See if it fries anything. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> Ah, uh, laser block! Which way are you rotating? There. It might not work without a power source. Luckily, I have an infinite power source down there. Wasn't that convenient? Uh, infinite power source of death and destruction. Oh, you're not very big, are you?
Boink. This is the dumbest idea ever. Do I? Wait. It, oh, okay. I might not even be able to use it like that. Boink. What if I... What if I went eight? Rotate. Ro 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 rotate. There. And then, and then, and then I went... Plug it directly into the infinite power source of death and destruction. Because you know, plugging lasers directly into the power socket is always a good idea. Huh? Strange. Oh, okay. In out. There. Beep. No, it doesn't work. Eh. Can't always win. Now, where's that chest go? Giant chest of doom. Hey, why am I sticking that right? <laughs> That's not a good idea. Upside down chest. It works every time. <laughs> Team Rocket is blasting off again. Wait, what's that on my front? I don't know. Pew 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 pew. pew. Whoa 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 whoa. Where are we going? I have no idea. I'm flying. Will I suffocate and lose everything? I don't know. I can't save. I'm in space. Whoa. I'm just looking back just in case I need to emergency land and all that stuff. Whoa. Whoa. This is so cool. Oh, and so now that I'm off planet, I'm flying a lot quicker than before. Makes a lot of sense. What's in the middle there? A, a blue sun or something? I'm drifting way too fast. Is that a lava planet? I think it's lava. A very strange lava, but still lava. <laughs> My little planet is all the way over there. I may never return. <laughs> is that that horrifying map that I spent ages and ages wandering around on? What is that little blue, blo uh, blue glowy thing? I don't know. I would say it's a sun, but it's a very strange place for a sun to be. I don't want to risk going uh, uh, close to it without having you know, emergency supplies in case I die. Whoa. Oh, this is so cool. I need to find somewhere to land though. I don't know where I want to land where I'll find robots to kill. Where's that big tall thing in the middle there? Should I go check it out? I feel like I should check it out. This is so weird. To know that you can land on there and have stuff happen. Everyone likes stuff. Is that a big ass building? And now it was on the planet that I was wandering around on? I don't know if it's a big ass building. Uh, what is it? I don't know. Is that that giant tree that I walked past? Because that would make sense. But it looks like a giant big ass building because I've never explored here. Oh my god, it's got a landing pad and everything. Will I get my ass shot up? Is this safe for me to be in? 
Servitory East Area High Facility. Uh, anybody home? I don't like the look of this. Should I even be here? Um, it looks of a run. No robots, like. Is this a safe place? Whoa, what did I just find? Oh, more ESDs. Oh, if I die, I don't lose myself. Health? Can I make more of them? Neat! Do I want to make more? Not at the moment. What's this? I do not think I will get out of this wretched place alive, and I hope that this final letter will bring me to the peace of mind. I need to embark on my last journey, after which I shall cast myself from the window. Ooh. Welcoming grassy floor below. Ooh, morbid! When we arrived, it was to check the land for any signs of those cogsmen. But Otis took the liberty to refill part of the ground floor and... Wait, I mean refit part of the ground floor and install some sort of research lab. Everything was going fine for a while and neither the skirmishes with the cogs nor the hard weather deterred our hopes. Nor made o Otis's efforts waver. One day after recon mission, she told us she found an alien artifact that might be the key to the war effort. And it would be a whole bunch of feathers in our caps, so she went and devoted some of her time each day to study it. This didn't end well, did it? After a while, she stayed more and more in her lab. Eventually, she stopped leaving, naming me Acting Commander. I guess I should have been alarmed by her behavior and warned High Council. But I tended to help her. Uh, wait, tended to her? Oh, wait, yeah. Helped her in her research and listened to her. Maybe this is my mistake. I shall forever bear the burden of that faithful decision. She told me her lab wasn't enough. She was nearing a breakthrough. She just needed a few more days. We should select a few soldiers and secretly build another lab, hidden from sight. Again, I didn't question her. She was my CEO, so I handpicked a few men and we got to work. When her secret lab was finished, she kept the soldiers. We heard what she did to them. The men wanted to warn High Council. I, I stopped them, and she sealed the entrance to her lair. It's been two days since I stopped hearing orders. It is time. Wow. So that was more plans for flight, hey? If, you know, I didn't have that mission. Of course, I would have had to have found this place, which would have been another matter entirely. D do I continue exploring this place, knowing that there's probably death awaiting me around the corner? Hey, do new. Uh. Wait, is this it? So, I'd have to go from ground floor, maybe? Oh, wait, here we go. I don't want to explore this anymore. I might come back to it later while I go on my voyage to find plans. Oops, don't shoot it, don't shoot it! Wow, that looks pretty cool. It's pretty fucking stupid, but still cool. Whoa, don't spin, don't spin, don't spin. Yeah, she lost her mind, even though there was something really went horribly wrong. Uh, let's see, where do I going to do next? What planet would have the best chance of finding evil robots of death and destruction to fight and steal plans from? Meow. What would happen if I got out of my ship now? Would I ever be able to get it back? That'd be such a stupid idea. Ooh, is that is that a robot planet? Is that a robot planet? No, that looks like a normal planet. What is this planet? Uh, I am kind of drifting a lot. I would like to stop drifting now. Wow, this thing's kind of heavy on the drift, ain't it? Oh, look at that tiny, tiny baby planet! I'm gonna stop on it just because it's so tiny. I wanna see the baby planet. 
Come on, baby planet. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wow. This is so cool. <laughs> it's so cool and so weird. Hey, King Kai, you're out here somewhere. Wait, whoa, wait, wait, wait. What do we got here? King Kai. Hello. Anybody home? Whoa. Now if only I had a way of restoring my sa uh, my spot, so that way if I die, I don't, you know, go to bad places like other planets that don't have spaceships. <laughs> that is so cool. Like, is there a respawn function that I can throw on my ship? I should look. <laughs> that way I always spawn at my ship. It'll be perfect! Thank you for everything you've done around the mercy- wait, 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 is that- is that all you're gonna tell me? No! I don't know what to do! I don't know what planet would be safe for me to land on! Cause I know that you mentioned beforehand that there was a planet with other m team members on. I just don't know where that planet is! I need it! I need it for my continued survival! Going up? Wait, let's go take a look at those clouds. You think I can walk on them? Or can I just fly through them? I've always wondered whenever I've seen them. That is so cool. Did I just bump into it? Oh! Oh my god, I'm bumping into them! That is cool! Don't want to risk getting off, just in case I fall through. But that is so cool! <laughs> That's a very strange looking world. Whoa, is this a robot world? The cube! Is there gravity? I don't know and I feel like it'd be a very silly idea for me to get out. What is... this is clearly one of those teleporters, but... I feel like if I land here, I'm pretty much gonna die. Yeah, I just saw one of those flying things just fly past my head. Not exactly what I need. Far out! At least I know there's an evil robot homeworld, just... Not what I want to be at! <laughs> I kind of want to live! That was the whole point of trying to find a place for me to get stuff. Yo, know, living? Well, there's green there, maybe it's safe. <laughs> no, no, it's not. Nothing's ever that easy. Ooh, what is that? Oh no, it's nothing. We're going in for a crash landing, Captain! So sure, where are we now? Whoa! What is that? What the heck is that? I feel like just getting next to it is gonna kill me. It's kind of creepy looking, actually. Whoa! What am I looking at? It's so cool and so weird. Are all of these things deserts? I think it is. It's one big desert. 
I'm kind of terrified to go on in there. I don't want to risk exploderizing just yet. And we come through. Please stop. Okay. Wait. Ooh. Wait, what, what, what the? What the? The noises I'm making is so adorable. Oh my god. That's so adorable! I have to kill it! I couldn't help it, it's so adorable! And it gave me glow blocks! Oh my god! How could anything so cute be so killable? Wait. Um. You guys didn't hear that last bit. <laughs> Going up. I think I cheated and went straight to the end of the dungeon. Which makes me wonder where this secret dungeon is. What the hell's going on? Is there something wrong with this elevator? Does it not like working? Is it terrifying me? Has Clang infested another game? I don't know, but... Oh! <laughs> Clang has infested another game! Clang has invested in another game! <laughs> Clang, I love you! Don't leave me! <laughs> Clang, I'm now worshipping you. Anyone on uh, who can't see the camera? Well, too bad. Oh, Clang, I stay fear your terrifying awesomeness. Please don't squish me in my endeavors to conquer this universe. Oh, mighty Clang, oh. What happens if I push the button? <gasps> okay. Don't push the button. <laughs> Pretend, wait, what happens if I... No, no. I'll do that on the way down. I was going to say, what happens if I release the button and let it drop to the floor? <laughs> what is this? Is this a secret? It is, uh... It is nothing. It is strange. Doing, 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 doing. Yes, I'm already at the top. Bugger. Too soon, too soon. Can I pinch these things? Wait. Oh, yes! I'll take that for my base whenever I get around to making it. I gotta find somewhere I wanna put it. <laughs> Let's go test the Clang uh, Clang Evader. <laughs> New. You, will you will you drop? Whoa! Why wouldn't it let me go? Wh why did I respawn with all my stuff? I'm supposed to not respawn with all my stuff. Now how am I supposed to test the clang elevator? I can't get back up there without an elevator. This episode has been one of much exploration, and I haven't gotten much done at all. <laughs> I'm very curious about what's going on and how to further my progress. Would have been nice if, uh, if the guy told me what planet to go to to find people, but eh, uh, I'm making do. Is that toxic waste? Whoa, is that a building? What am I looking at? If I go in here, will I die? Radioactive plant? Because that's not utterly terrifying at all! Crap! 
that basket? Is that a car? Why are there cars on such a tiny planet? What is this place? It's like someone tore up chunks straight off the earth and, you know, made them all square. Maybe you know, someone blew up the earth and uh, with some sort of physics de uh, defying stunt made everything square and weird. Holy crap baskets. What the heck am I looking at? Whoa. Stellarium. Interesting. The Stellarium sounds like it could be useful. I am pinching it. I mean, it is called Stellar Overload. What better Stellar Overload than a Stellarium Overload? Uh, eh. Do I need to find some robots though? And does that mean that thing in the middle of the planet is like one giant stellarium? Wicked, that'd be cool. Just mine away at it. I'm worried about touching these though, I'm worried they'll burn my ass off. I think 700 should be enough. So still gotta find a place to go. I have no idea where I'm gonna go. And find some robots to kill. Cause they're exceedingly hard to find out here. I mean I heard they're supposed to be taking over the universe, but they're doing a very poor job of it. Well, not unless I go to the suicide planet. But I kind of, you know, want to live. I might not have much of a choice. I might have to go to the suicide planet. Luckily, I'm pretty sure I see it. Joy! Stop drifting! Makes it very difficult to fly. What is this? Are they treats? What am I looking at? Ooh, lots of flowers. There's no spiders here, is there? I don't like spiders. It's the white planet. Needed that bread. Where's the screen stuff? No. Why, why won't it let me se select the green stuff? I don't know what it is. Jade. So it's probably something I can get if I wasn't so low. If I didn't have such a weak glove or something? I don't know. <laughs> uh, scared the living crap out of me. Point, point, point. You're not the robots I need. So let's go put stuff in the cargo. Uh, can I reach the cargo? Oh, oh, no, no! This is not what I wanted. Um... So, this is not how I expected this episode to end. Not in the slightest. Um, I'm doomed.
I'm not sure if I can recover from this. That is the end of this episode, and maybe the I don't know, but I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> I'm going to cry now. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this episode, you know what to do. Hit that like and subscribe button. Or share it with your friends. Otherwise, I'll see you all in the next galaxy. I mean, next time. <laughs> Clang, I'm now worshipping you. Anyone on uh, who can't see the camera? Well, too bad. Oh, Clang, I stay fear your terrifying awesomeness. Please don't squish me in my endeavors to conquer this universe. Oh my...